So here's something else I've been kind of excited to get. You can see this. It's a power built uh, tire step. And working on this truck and you know taller trucks from the ground, my old Chevrolet four wheel drive of 82, got 33 1250s on it. I had to let the air out of the front tires to get up and under the hood to work on it. I'm really excited for this because it does work on the front and the back tire. So when I'm hooking up and I need to reach in to hook up my, my emergency breakaway cable or reach up in there and grab the fifth wheel handle, I'm hoping it's going to work out really good for me. So I'm going to unbox it and then I'll try it on some things and see how it's going to work. But I really think you're going to see this a lot if you continue watching my videos because I don't see how that could be a life changer as far as getting in and out of the bed of a truck that sits up pretty tall off the ground. And I've also been asked, uh, I told some of my buddies about getting one, and they asked me, would it work on a dually? So we're going to try that too because the front sticks out a little bit further. So, Got a little bit of uh, paperwork that comes with it. it. Says this thing's good for up to 300 pounds, so I should be good with it. Um, and all you do is set that over your tire. I wish I'd have had it when I was on the knock sensor because that puts me right here at it and I had to come in from the front yeah this is gonna be this is gonna be money well spent I don't see how this isn't gonna be because now I will be able to reach right up under here up my step. Oh yeah, I'm gonna love that. Right here, the little rubber stoppers. They get against your wheels to keep you from marking your wheels. I like that. I never, didn't even look at that whenever I was looking at getting them. Or getting a step. And then here's your pins that you pull to raise and lower it up and down. These are adjustable so you can add a little bit of length to it. Go in or out. I'm really happy with this thing. Well now I can get right over top of what I'm working on. Almost like a top side creeper. That's something I want to get eventually one day too. Not that I think I'll be using a step this much for this truck, but I just wanted to show how much room was it there for a dually tire. Or a dually wheel with it sticking out a little bit another truck that I forgot I even had on the property it is actual it's a 2004 Let's see how it fits on it okay so still got three fingers between the wheel and the step and yeah Solid. Here it is on 331250 uh, General Grabber. This is the one I was worried about it not being big enough to go around. But it fits just super snug. And I'll show you what I did here is to adjust my hose it didn't take that much I pulled my pins and slid it out to the fourth hole and on my truck I think I was in the third hole 
on my with the 20s. And I just did both sides like that to the fourth hole. And then I screwed the little rubber snubbers all the way in. And yeah. So yeah, it even works on big trucks too, so. Would have been better if I'd have brought this gap in by going up to the second hole. But, as far as does it work, absolutely. A friend of mine was doing his service on his 2016 Dodge 2500 and uh, he was also changing the crankcase ventilation filter in the valve cover, and I let him try the step out. He said he would definitely have one before his next service was up. He really liked it. I guess I'm going to finish this video up. Um, I wanted to show the versatility of the power belt step, and I'm pretty excited about it. I didn't know it worked on a dually. I assumed it would work on the 33 1250s because it says it accommodates the 13-inch tire, and it did. Uh, I have heard from other people that on a 20 inch with an offset, you know, where the the tire's not flush, it's kind of got an offset to it where it's got a little dish to it, that can be rough because I believe from what I saw on mine, it will sit right on the outside edge of the wheel. But when you jump up to a 22 inch wheel, those little rubber snubbers that actually rest on the tire of the wheel will actually go inside of it. So if you have an offset wheel, you may want to look a little further into it. I didn't have anything to test that on. But I was really happy with the way it worked on the dually. I was really the 18 wheeler. I wasn't even expecting to try that. I just saw it, thought I'd throw it on there. Um, yeah, and that's the majority of what I want to do is unbox it, what you get in the box, and what I think of it. I, I love the, the non slip step, I love the adjustability and versatility of it that I've seen so far, and I'm looking forward to getting a lot of use out of that thing. So, if you guys liked the video, and I hope you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.